football fans were treated to a surprise performance from Westlife's Brian McFadden amid the musicians' collaboration with Boyzone and Chorley FC. As the Mirror exclusively revealed earlier this week, the Flying Without Wings hitmaker has joined forces with Ronan Keating, Shane Lynch and Keith Duffy with high hopes to take the Lancashire-based football club to the Premier League, in a bid to follow in the footsteps of Hollywood's Ryan Reynolds and shut up rapper Stormzy. The boy band members attended Chorley's home game against Solihull in the FA Trophy on Saturday, meeting fans, taking selfies and signing autographs as the boys prepare to sign on the dotted line, becoming shareholders of the town's non-league team. Despite a 3-1 loss for Chorley FC yesterday, the excitement didn't stop as Brian attempted to keep spirits high amongst fans. Inside one of the club's pitch side venues, McFadden jumped on stage with local band The Get Back Beats, performing a selection of Westlife's greatest hits. Videos and pictures obtained by the Mirror show crowds singing along with Brian as sources say it is just the beginning amid the club's exciting collaboration with the world-famous artists, with future concerts expected at Chorley FC's stadium. The result wasn't what they'd hoped for but it didn't change any of the vibes, everyone was in great spirits, an insider explained. The boys were golden all day long, they were very welcoming with the fans. They spent the time, they had pictures, and it was a really good vibe. Brian himself is a massive sports fan so just in the moment, in the vibe, he jumped up on stage doing a little bit for the fans. That's just how the day went down. It was good fun and good vibes, not too serious, the boys just had a real connection with everybody. Sources tell the Mirror the club's conversations with the boys' own and Westlife stars are going very well and that details will be finalized in the coming days. It comes after we were first to report the boy band members' involvement with the club and their plans for the group collaboration. Speaking exclusively to the Mirror last week, Shane said, I'm really looking forward to the weekend, we've got lots of exciting things in the pipeline. Really buzzing to attend the game on Saturday with some of the boys. It should be a really good year ahead. We're all excited to see what the future brings and what we've got planned. TV crews from all over the country headed to Chorley on Saturday as the lads opened up more about their involvement with the club. Shane's business partner bought the club seven months ago and asked Shane to get involved, Brian told reporters. Shane's not really a football man but he knew that me and Keith love football so he got us involved, and Ronan. We want to be part of something from the ground up. I'm a Manchester United fan myself, I've got season tickets at Old Trafford, but it's a corporation. You look at something like Chorley Football Club and you see this belongs to the town, it belongs to the people, it belongs to the community. For us to be able to get involved in something at that level and to try and take it to the next level, there's a bit of romance to it. Follow Mirror Celebs on TikTok, Snapchat, Instagram, Twitter, Facebook, YouTube and Threads.